Consortium Empire said they were to do an unboxing of an Undaunted Normandy. Now this game is 14 plus 45 to 60 minutes, and you can only play this game at two players. Now with um, what I've seen, this game is a um, deck build and skirmish type game. And uh, we had uh, Undaunted Normandy. Uh, we already did the unboxing for the uh, Undaunted North Africa, or Africa, I think. Uh, yeah, North Africa and the reinforcements. So oh, yeah, we're just unboxing for those? Yeah, so we're just unboxing this one today. And of course, we'll be doing a playthrough review. Um, we'll be diving more into the mechanics during those times. So today we're just doing the unboxing. Okay, so it's open. Yep. It has won several awards. Uh, being an uh, army veteran, this is uh, right up my alley. So there's the cover. There's the back of the box. Served three years in the army, three years in the National Guard. Wow, this is uh, sealed very tight. Now, this happens uh, occasionally when uh, you first open a box. Hopefully it'll be easier from now on. It could also mean that the box is warped in some way. Yeah. So. This seems to be seemingly harder than normal. Yeah, it is a little warped right here. I don't know if you could tell. Yeah. And so I think that caused the seal to uh, seal differently. All you have to do is not try and break it. It's tough. Wow. Yeah, it's still a lot. It's a, the warp, that little warpness in that box. Come on! Oh, wow. Finally. You did it. It's like opening up a chest. Sorry for that struggle. <laughs> But uh, any game board collector knows that that happens occasionally. So here we have the scenario book. And so you can pick different scenarios um, for different battles. I'm guessing you read this while you play the game. Uh, no, it's pretty much uh, for setup. Oh, okay. There's different like setups for e each scenario so it can change. I thought it was like they walk you from your scenario. No, I think these are uh, like actual battles that occurred, mm -hmm. how they were set up, and then you try to battle. Uh, Against your other player? Yeah. So, That's pretty unique game design. Yeah. So you're playing different battles in history. Yeah. But here's all the different setups, scenarios. Um, Hill 314. I think I saw that movie. Sounds familiar. Okay. Now we have the Undaunted Rule Book. Here's the Rule Book. So you have components, you have units, so you have scouts, uh, riflemen, squad leaders, fog of war, you have tokens, combat counters, you have snipers, gunners. Here we have set up, how to play, actions, example round, game end, the platoon, the platoon continued. And say so you have, uh, let's see, platoon sergeant, platoon guide, squad leader, rifleman, scout, machine gunner, sniper, mortar. Okay. It's always the different characters that you can draft. Here's Osprey Games, London 2nd Edition. 69 minutes playtime. Looks pretty cool. Yeah. Here's the Lost Expedition. 
That's like one of those like never carjacking type game. Yeah, a game of survival in the Amazon. Oxford Games has a lot of quick games. Yeah, they do. So here we have uh, punch outs. Some of the punch outs, riflemen, scouts, snipers. Um, Make sure I have this in the camera. Even more punch outs. Uh, same thing. Rifleman, gunner, scout, mortar, sniper. Yeah. Okay, here we have some of the tiles that you'll be using for the different scenarios. You notice uh, some of them have like, looks like a farmland, um, some of more cities or tents. And so, Rivers. Uh, I'm interested in to see how this game plays out. It seems like there'll be a bridge. lot of strategy in this game. And then there's tiles in the back. Oh, Forest. There's, oh, there's a house. Yeah, house. I wonder if these affect the gameplay, the houses, the hills. It would have to. Wow, that's a huge house. It's like a mansion. Yep. Here we have uh, dice. So a whole bunch four of dice. Four dice. It's one thing I like about the uh, un Undaunted games. The inserts, they're really well made. I always like when games have inserts and when you can fit them perfectly. Yeah. And there's enough space to fit them when they're not super tight inserts. Okay. Here we go. I think it's two decks of cards. So here's the back of the cards. Here's the front. So we have Platoon Sergeant, Platoon Guide, Sniper, Mortar. We have probably a few of those. Squad leader, rifleman. Rifleman. Oh, rifleman. Scout. A bunch of scouts, I'm guessing. Machine gunner. Quite a few. Squad leader. <coughs> There's some more riflemen. Some more scouts. Uh, I'm guessing the uh, different colors, like green is for one team and red's for the other team. Machine gunner? No, the second, this is one team and then the other deck's a different team. Oh, okay. Squad leader. So a whole bunch of, like, when they put the squad leader with their, obviously their platoon or uh, fog of war. A whole bunch of fog of war. Wow. That deck has a bunch of fog of war. Okay, this is the other deck. The platoon sergeant in the front. That one was also one, two. Yeah. Yeah. Here's the back of this one. Platoon guide, sniper, mortar. Looks like it's in the same or similar order. Squad leader, rifleman. Scout, machine gunner, squad leader, oh, a whole bunch of riflemen, scout, Oops. machine gunner, squad leader. It's just gonna be a bunch of fog of wars here. Rifleman, scout. Machine gunner. Yep. Yeah, a whole bunch of fog and war. I'm guessing they're the, they're the same cards in the deck. Yeah. Okay, so that's everything included in the box. Um, we will be doing a playthrough and review the game. We're really excited to play this game. This game looks pretty cool. Very strategic card mm. drafting skirmish game. Yeah, so we like um, pretty much uh, two player games when it's just me and Quentin. So I guess we 
we're kind of fast at playing. So mm -hmm. if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Uh, social media is down below in the description. I might have a link of where I buy the game. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye.